Hello everyone, I'm Extra Cheesy 87 and this is Let's Play Persona 3 Portable Part 11. In the previous video we finished off the second block of Tartarus. We got to flex our God Gamer status by defeating uh, the, the big statue with no luck involved. But you think, I mean, we, did, we didn't even get like lucky actually, we actually got a little unlucky. Our real luck was having so many magic mirrors. But even then, the magic mirrors weren't that, they only ever blocked poison mists. So in reality, we actually got rather unlucky. All this time, there was a Persona user in the class next door. What am I supposed to be doing? I think we said we're going to go do student council. Would I, would I actually say I was going to do student council? That doesn't sound like me. Hey, let's see, can we find Mitsuru? Is she still hiding from me? She's still in that, ah, oh, fuck. I said I'd get a present if they got top 10. I didn't actually think they'd do it. No, I could never show my face again. We could also do home ec. I'm not really in a, a rush to start. Well, we maybe could just go ahead and start that one and unlock it. I don't even remember what 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 arcana you are. Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Fridays. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Go ahead and unlock it. Home economics room, fashion club. Uh, Yata, yes, this is the best suing I have done. The foreign exchange student you met at the bookstore is busily suing. Sewing. Uh, hello. Oh, konnichiwa, hello. I haven't seen you since the bookstore. You came. I am very happy. Uh, how do you know my name? I am the teacher, my sensei. We are in the same grade. This is Tanashi, very fun. Would you like to try? It seems Bebe wants you to join. I mean, maybe we should try. Ponto, really? I got to, thank you. We, I am here Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Before tests, they won't let me in. I was sad because I did not have any Tomodachi friends since I came to Nihon, Japan. But now I am happy. You've joined Fashion Club. You now understand Bebe a little better. <laughs> Straight to the fucking point. the hell is that oh it's temperance i think yeah yeah i know i know stuff you've established the transfer student social link of the temperance arcana and we're technically a transfer student whoa look at the time well then extra sama uh, goodbye Oh, by the way, I was wondering how you bid farewell in Nihongo Japanese. Uh, goodbye? Is that an answer? I have no clue. I'm between second and fourth option. My heart says this one. I understand. Kiki Dene. I have no clue. Oh god, did I just tell this man a curse word? You decided to go back to the dorm? Oh fuck. Oh, hey. Yeah, uh, hey, I may have just gotten a student in trouble. For the fashion student, he's in the mail route. I don't remember if there's any changes uh, in this like version or not. Because some of the social links that are in the female route and the male route have have like small tweaks, I believe. I don't know, it's been so long since I've played the actual like just regular male route that I don't really remember. But I seem to remember noticing the changes when I originally played Portable, like eight years ago. Because it was like I played Persona 3 Fez or FES, whatever you want to call it in like 2011 and then I played portable in like 2014 so it was a bit more fresh in my mind back then and that was before I got like early onset Alzheimer's at the age of like 18 and like just completely lost my memory for everything now that's a joke but it's also kind of true I didn't used to have such a bad memory dude my persona is getting stronger it's really good at physical attacks its skills don't really change that much is that why my grades are so low? I didn't know you had skills too. I, I was just I was just joking, man. Now I'm depressed. That's too bad. Her name is Fuka, right? 
other than electricity skills, it seems like Persona can only learn status orient moves. Status orient skills are very useful. Power isn't the only thing that wins battles. Can't believe my Persona is actually teaching me something. I mean, debuffs are very strong. I'm a little disappointed about Fukukun as well. I mean, it's quite difficult to find someone who has the potential. Would you feel more assured if you had more team members? Hell yeah. Thankfully, Akahiko Kun has rejoined the team. I'm okay with who we have. But if any of you become ill, the strength of the team will drastically decrease. Depending on so few members puts us in a very precarious position. How can I help you? Hello. My reward? I'm a little bit harder, so I'm always amazed at how many floors are in it. The tower reaches to the skies. It's going to be a long and arduous journey. My reward? I got top 10. You're supposed to give me something. Fine. We'll just get top one next time and you'll be forced to give me something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's probably still just working on it, right? Because <laughs> it, it's just going to be such an amazing gift that it's just not ready yet. Right? Right? This game? This game? This game? Bro, it's impossible to level up your academics. No one has ever gotten rank one. I don't believe it. What's up, dude? So what do you think? What do I think about what? What are you excited about? Oh yeah, of course you would be two interesting girls. Talking about that- hey, I resent that. That's, I was talking about that Fukuyama Gishi girl. I know I've s seen her before. She does look kind of weak, but only makes me want to protect her, you know? <laughs> I still haven't given up hope that she'll join our team. Have we asked? <laughs> I'm Edagawa, in charge of interrogative learning. <laughs> in this class, I'll ease all your worries. It's psychotherapy through magic. All right, everyone, be very, very quiet. No talking, silence. Were you surprised to hear me bring up magic? It's a recent proposal, so it's not well known yet. Here it is, those who believe will be saved. Study hard and I can beat your weak minds into shape. <laughs> now then, let us get on with our first lecture on the basics of magic. Who can use magic and who cannot? That'll be our starting point. Some of you might think that magic lets you do absolutely anything. Pulling pranks on people, hurting your enemies, actually just lets you cast Aji, Zio, Garu, and some game Zan. If that's what you think, then you'll never learn magic. It's true of both Eastern and Western sorcery. Those with wicked hearts will either be powerless or driven to ruin. There's one more thing that can't be forgotten in learning magic. That is, a master. You should aspire to become as good as your predecessors, especially if you're studying difficult magic. If you don't have a master, learning the black arts will be impossible. When you begin your training, you'll have to live in two worlds at once, the real world and the dark realm. If you can't distinguish between the two, you're headed for certain disaster. That's why the presence of a master is of utmost importance. With that in mind, I'll move on to meditation, a standard practice in magical training. I have some handouts for you. You feel tired, close your eyes? God, hell no, this is the best class. Now then, looks like it's time. If you're interested in the subject, try meditating before going to bed. So we recall the events of the day. It's like traveling back through time. If you could do that flawlessly, you may just make a good magician. <laughs> That's all for today. You told me this man's getting paid to teach us this shit? Japan is fucked. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I really like saying that. That's going to be the catchphrase for the Let's Play. Could talk to you, but I don't have a hermit, so I will not. Hey, Mitzi, Mitzi, you're you're legally required to show up and give me a present. You just didn't want to give me a present at the dorm, right? 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 I saw your exam results. Good work. Here it is from the chairman. It's a reward for effectively balancing school and battle. A page card set? What the hell is that? What? Does it do anything? Oh, okay, it's the- okay. Mitsuru, what the hell? You gave me something I can't even use yet? Because I think we can't use that until the antique shop is open? You think that's real fucking funny, don't you, Mitsuru? Hello, Extra Coon. I'm still looking for the smoker. Tell me if you find it. Where, where did the smoker... Did I just, like, zone out during the first event? I think it's possible. Might sound weird, but isn't it a pain to reply to messages from people you don't really care about? Uh, nah, not really. 
She's sure patient when dudes like girls like that. Well, I don't get messages, so it's not a much of a problem. I know, right? Damn, she's so persistent. She must have some kind of iron will to follow me around this much. Probably be a detective or something when she grows up. Did you see that? He threw a rock at a bird resting on that branch. That's so cool. Anybody in the gym? Can I go to the swim team? Only a men's swim team? What the hell? I gotta play tennis. I can't go swimming. What am I doing? I mean, we can talk to Junpei and Hermit Lady. And Fashion Club was Fridays, right? It was like Tuesday, Wednesdays, Fridays. Yeah. All right, we'll talk to Junpei. Even though I think it said he's still not gonna level up, right? Little fuck. It's gonna be like our third time talking to Junpei. Gonna treat you to a meal. You okay with the special? If you want, you can put an extra egg on top. Come on, eat up! Junpei's awfully generous. Um, did something good happen? Uh, not exactly, but Junpei seems slightly embarrassed. Y you look like you're in high spirits, like always. Junpei seems to leave for some reason. Uh, what do you mean? Well, Junpei seems hesitant to speak. Wait, so you haven't heard? Guess I should have brought it up. Okay, okay, I'll tell you. Oh no, we're playing the investigative music. <laughs> oh god, Junpei, what did you do? Don't get mad at me, okay? Supposedly there are photos of you going around. They aren't weird pictures or anything. They're of you in your gym clothes. There are other girls in them too, but you're right in the center, so... I think whoever took the pictures was aiming specifically at you. Um, how did you find out about this? One of the guys in a different class found it. I didn't take the pictures. Uh, shut up. He came over to me and was like, Is this that girl in your dorm? I took that copy of it away from him, but the original's still out there. Junpei looks troubled. Dude, you must really be popular. This kind of thing isn't normal. I wonder if it'll, I'll be in danger of having a picture of me taken with you. I'd have to find out who it was and kick his ass if that happened. Alright, moving on. <laughs> but seriously, be careful, alright? Junpei seems genuinely concerned about you. You feel like your bond with Junpei has grown a little stronger. Oh man, do we get to beat up a stalker? That sounds fun. Just scorch him alive. How to go about retrieving that picture? Oh, uh, I'll think about it. Don't let it bother you too much. But man, photos? What in the world did anyone use that for? Uh, never mind. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you and Junpei talk for a while before heading back together. Welcome back. That's strange. The number of victims seems to be on the rise again. Apparently, that decline was only temporary. Does that mean that no matter how many shadows you defeat, more will just keep coming? If that's the case, then what's the point of fighting? If we do nothing, then everyone will eventually join the Lost. Our efforts have prevented the crisis from escalating. I guess you're right. You know, it's kind of creepy when you think about it. If we couldn't use our personas, then the whole city would be crawling with zombies. How can I help you? What up? The equipment of the command room is still malfunctioning. I don't know the details, but it's causing some sort of unforeseen error. Okay, we can go check that out. Junpei? Akihiko? Saving the city, right, Senpai? Of course, why would you ask such an obvious question? Well, you know, I was just thinking it might be nice to get some kind of thank you. From the ladies, at least. I wouldn't count on anyone getting appreciation from anyone, since no one knows what we're doing. I know that makes things harder, but if we don't fight, then more people will become victims of the shadows, like the lost. You are making a difference, though. We're making the city more peaceful. Just remember that. And then occasionally we pluck a card out of the air, and then we get an instant payday. So, you know, that's not all bad. No new recordings? You lied to me, Mitsuru. Oh, it's still malfunctioning. There's no new recordings. You know what? I'm gonna go take pictures and think about how much I'm mad that you gave me some garbage for my reward. Anything going on in here? What do you know? Oh no, you're the rocking guy.
Print club, print club. Photo came out fantastically. Oh, oh, oh we can talk to Akihiko now. I don't even remember what he is. I think he's like stars or something. Stars. You overhear a conversation. I heard from a younger guy in my club yesterday that the 10th graders are teasing someone. What, like bullying him? Poor kid, what's his name? I don't know. All I heard is that it's really a problem. I thought our school was peaceful too, but I guess it's not so much. I am down, class. It's time to begin today's lecture. Prodigo Adorukum Shinderumum. Mr. Okuda left to work early today, so today's lecture will be a little different. He looked fine, but he claimed he didn't feel well. Make sure you know what you're eating, everyone, before you take a bite. Last time I related some basic magical knowledge. Today I'll add to that with a discussion of meditation, but you did that already. But first, let's review the ways that magicians meditate. The heighten your creative impulse, the source of all magical power. Carefully observe a real-world object and recreate in your head to the last detail. That's the Western style, but I like to talk about the Eastern style of meditation. Meditation was actually refined in the East. Modern magicians adapted Eastern meditation for their own original style. Straighten yourself, take a deep breath, and concentrate. These are the basics of Eastern meditation. You don't need much to meditate. All that's required is some quiet environment and time. It doesn't take long, but you should allot at least 15 minutes for it. Now for the practicalities. First, your posture. Choose a position you're comfortable in. Sitting cross-legged is easy for most, or you could try the full lotus position, called the Kekafuza. Keka, kekafuza. You can also meditate while sitting on any chair. Any position will work, as long as you're relaxed. Once you breathe comfortably, cover or close your eyes and relax. Now you've prepared yourself physically, it's focused on your mind and soul. Imagine a symbol, perhaps a large tree or the moon. If you wish, it could even be the god of your own faith. However, do not empty your mind. I would actually be foolhardy. You run the risk of losing control of yourself. You feel tired. Absolutely not, man. This is this is what we came to school for. What have you learned? To practice meditation is to imagine some sort of a symbol. The Christian practice of prayer, for instance, is a heightened form of meditation. The imagined symbol is there for other reasons besides helping the meditation go smoothly, however. It can be very dangerous to plumb the depths of your consciousness. By keeping a clear symbol in mind, you can avoid plunging over the edge. Go ahead and try and meditate if you like. That's all for today. That is actually longer than some of the social links. Like, the, the total amount of words in his speech is more... Like, the word count is higher than some of the social links. Like, I, I legitimately believe that. I think that's like... That was at least, like, ranks 1 through 8 of the old couple. In, like, total words. Ah, there you are. I've been looking for you. Hey, Shosama, you are coming to see Fashion Glow? Uh, I was thinking about it. Ah, uh, Yata, now I won't be the only one. I'll be waiting outside your classroom. Oh, fuck. I don't have a, I don't have a temperance. I shouldn't have said yes. I just, I can't say, I can't say no to him. I feel bad. Gekukon High School Hallway. Ah, <sighs> what a workout. I've got to teach those freshmen how to clean up properly. Oh yeah, why couldn't we join the archery club? That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> we were playing tennis. Hmm? So, I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone. She freaked out and started crying. Like, it was the end of the world. You should have seen the look on her face. It was priceless. Oh my god! I have never laughed so hard in all my life. <laughs> They're making fun of someone. And she hits up with an arrow. Don't they have anything better to do? Huh? Where's that voice coming from? What voice? I don't hear anything. Is What's the wrong, Dark Lord Maki? Beelzebub? Maki? Uh, uh huh? Are you okay? Sorry. What were we talking about? about time they left. I can't stand girls like that. Class is in it for today. Well, all right. It's not my problem. Oh, God, he's just standing there. Innocently. I don't have temperance. I shouldn't have said yes. I don't have a temperance. It's not efficient. I'm sorry, baby. The other day I had a dream about Mitsuri-senpai. 
What about Akihiko? We could try and talk to him. What are you shopping for? I need new clothes. Yeah, cause... Oh yeah, also Shrine Girl? Are you available? Yeah, your, your ass is not available? Unless you're somewhere else? How's the cat going? None? Still no cat for you? Alright, I guess we'll go and lock Akihiko. Wait, what? I was skipping work the other day and I saw this young man. He had long hair and no shirt on. He was like one of those hippies from back in the day. Does that look coming back into style? Did Japan have hippies? I mean, I don't know, maybe. Recently, this girl started coming around here. She wears this white dress with this puffy lace. I don't know what kind of fashion that is, but it's not my style. Monorail was nearly in a big accident the other day. I heard it was just a few feet away. Just like one of those action thrillers, you know? Whoever stops that train's a real life hero. Thank you. Sure, if you work hard, I think you can make it. Do you think I could become a first stringer? Still don't sell anything? Why do you exist? Hello, kitty cat? Remember this one dude was different from the rest. He comes here, but he never talks to anybody. He just sits in this little corner. Wonder what he's up to. I heard people saying that dude looks stronger than he looks. Or he is stronger than he looks. He's a loner. His clothes are kind of old, but he's cool. What are you guys talking about? Last week was my 15th wedding anniversary. A lousy husband didn't give me anything. He didn't even remember it was our anniversary. Seriously, Japanese men are so clueless when it comes to those things. Even a single flower from Rafalesa make, make us happy. Okay. Not open yet? I know this guy from when I was your age. He's a grave digger. He told me when you die, I'll dig you a fine big grave. It was nice of them. Good friends are a blessing, they really are. Sir, what the hell are you talking about? Arcade games only start when you put a coin in, not like the home consoles when you turn them on. I didn't realize how they worked until my friend told me. What about you? You got any friends that help you out with that? I'm okay on my own. You sure, man? I mean, what if you come up against a problem you can't solve on your own? No one's perfect. You should have friends who can help you in case you get into a jam. You're like an idiot like me who doesn't understand how arcade games work. Jack Ross, hee ho. First try, hee ho. Like I'd ever not get Jackie Jack. Uh, sorry, Jack Frost, it's okay if you don't want to join the squad just yet. Whenever you're ready, hee ho. Uh, you know, it's fine. I understand you're like a high class dude, so you need more than a couple hundred yen to join the part. Hee ho! Ja Jack Frost? Ja Jack Frost? Jack Frost? Ja Jack Frost? I'm not leaving until I get it. Where's my escalating odds? My loot box? I refuse. I, there's no way we're not going to get it. It sounded different that time. Yes! Worse. You see, the thing is that he he's a he-ho. So, of course, it's worth it. Anything new here? Oh. Oi, Weibo. Worn black cloth. I right, see ya. I guess I'll, can we, I don't even think we can make a temperance. I'm back. Make a unicorn. You're not shrugging, it's a wind. We can make you, but it would require using Jack Frost, which will never happen. Alright, fine. We're just gonna talk to Akihiko.
go ahead and unlock him. Where are you? I don't think we'll really do too much with Akihiko for a while because we don't even have a persona that matches him. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. We're going to watch a movie at the theater by the train station. Have you heard about the ghost in the whole mech room? Yeah, I did. I'm impressed. You know the school pretty well. Like, hey, we talked about you. To you about that? Alright, if I was Akihiko, where would I be? I would be down here, yeah. It's you. You going home? Want to walk home? Okay, do you mind if we stop somewhere on the way? Somewhere, uh, something I've been in the mood for. You can feel the glares of all the girls you've walked past. Are they Akihiko fans? And then you judo chopped them. You're able to deflect their glares to your overwhelming charm. You think it'd be courage that you'd need. Alright, let's go. Iwatoda Strip Mall, Hagakura Ramen. Akihiko brought you here. You're okay with the special, right? Two extra large specials, please. Um, yeah, let's fucking eat it up. I mean, it feels kind of rude, but I feel like he'd appreciate it. Yeah, eat as much as you like. Akihiko seems happy for some reason. Physical strength is everything. Well, maybe. Your skills are truly remarkable. It won't be of any use if you get exhausted easily. Akihiko seems to be worried about you in his own way. In any case, you decided to eat the extra large ramen brought to your table. Damn right. Amazing, you completely polished that off. You somehow managed to eat it all, but your stomach is groaning. The meat dimension. Hey, you up for going to another restaurant? Akihiko, what the hell? Uh, another meal, let's go. Are you sure you don't look so well? Don't let yourself suffer just to be friendly, seriously. Akihiko seems to sigh inwardly. Fuck. You must have a really small- What the hell are you talking about? You don't eat right, you'll never grow stronger? I feel like Akihiko is treating you like a child. Why are you glaring at me like that? I'm not Junpei, I won't get easy on you just because you're a girl. Mitsuru is the one who recommended you be our leader, and I thought you'd be best in that position too. You do your best and do a good job, okay? Did you not see our extreme battle tactics of abuse items that we got for free? Due to luck? Our lives are on the line too, after all. And of course, we'll do our best to back you up as well. You're not the only one who's out there who's going to be trying hard out there. You can sense Akihiko's care for you. I feel like you understand Akihiko a little now. Oh. Pew, shoo, meow, persona unlocked. Okay, you are star. I don't even know if we like. I think the only star we've seen is like Neko Shogun, who's like level 19. We might not even beat the game before we get to level 19. Now that's obviously not true, but it feels like that sometime. You may now earn an XP bonus when fusing personas of the Star Arcana. But I did want to go ahead and unlock him. Since we're done eating, I guess we should go back. Let's get a quick jog in to help settle our stomachs. You and Akihiko jog back to the dorm by cheered you on. Oh, hey! Hello. How can I help you? When I look up a tart, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fight an enemy who uses electricity with my eyes closed. I don't suffer much, da much damage from electricity. That ice is a different story. Wait a minute, isn't Mitsuru's persona strong with ice? My persona is another side of me, and ice is my weakness. Is it just me, or does there seem to be a connection there? Dude, my persona is getting stronger. Stronger. Don't you just hate bullying? Yeah. I think it's a mad when I hear about someone getting bullied. I don't really care. Be careful, not caring is a form of bullying. I mean, that is true, but you didn't say shit back there. Don't act like you're better than me. You could have intervened and told those girls to fuck off, or else you'll hit them with your bow, and you didn't. Now, I'm not saying you're a bad person for not saying anything. You're the one who said you're a bad person for not saying anything. So you're the one who's called yourself a bad person. Ergo facto, I'm quiz gaming. And we're going to be the godliest gamer by the end of this game. We just, we just go to the arcade every single night because <laughs> there's nothing else to do. You overhear a conversation. You hear that 11th grader? Oh yeah, the one who was lying on the ground this morning, right? Hope she just ran away from home, but I feel like this is the start of something big. Yeah, there might be reporters and camera crews and stuff. I don't want to deal with it. Did you hear about that girl in 2E? Yeah, they haven't got a clue. Isn't that bizarre? Everyone is talking about a rumor that's going around. Man, can you believe these people? So, did you hear the details? No. 
I'm not interested. Stop acting like you don't care. <laughs> you really should hear this. But I mean, I don't. Well, a girl from 2E went missing last night. This morning, they found her lying on the ground in front of the school gate. Nobody knows what happened, and supposedly, she's still unconscious. Morning. Yo, Yucatan. This is a tough case, even for Junpei Iori. Ace detective? Absolutely not. Ace detective? Are you stupid or something? More like stupe ace defective. Whoo, man. That's a, that's a, that's a banger right there, isn't it, Yukari? Hey, I resent that. Anyway, where have you been? I was talking to the teacher. That girl they found? I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. She seemed okay then. Whoa. Now that's really strange. Well, all right, time for Fashion Club. <laughs> Class is in for today. What are we doing Saturdays? Pretty close to Aki. You got Simpa? No way. Um. And those are the old folks. We'll check the shrine, see if girl is there. You are. We could try and unlock you. Or we could finish the old folks. We'll try and finish. I don't know if we're quite ready yet. We might need like two more sessions. Well, we'll do old folks definitely tomorrow, so we'll talk to you, I guess. Controller's been disconnected. Oh, fuck. Okay, reconnected. I don't know. I still, I still haven't quite figured out that bug with Steam where if like a controller disconnects, it like crashes all of Steam, which uh, is a little scary. I was waiting for you. Let's play. Uh, sure. Let's play. Sign to play with Micah. What do you want to do next? It's up to you, okay? Your choice. Uh, jungle gym. I'm gonna climb up way high, okay? Oh shit. But I don't want to go home yet. I don't like it there. Micah seems sad. Can we stay together for a little longer? Micah seems to enjoy hanging out. You got to know Micah, the grade schooler. You're the hanged man? The hanged girl? <laughs> You've established the girl at the shrine socially. You may earn an XP bonus. Well, mom and dad, they fight a lot. They're going to get a divorce, huh? Well... I mean, realistically, hopefully, yes. If they're fighting a lot, it's probably better to just go ahead and break it off than, you know, put your kid through that. I tell them I'm, I want us to be happy, but they don't listen. They probably hate me, too. Hey, can we play again later, right? I think we're friends now. I'm here on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays. I'll be waiting for you. You decide to go back to the dorm. I do like how the actual oh, hey. animation for unlocking the... Social Link was longer than the actual dialogue of the Social Link. I think that's another one that was in the original game. You hear the rumor going around school? People can be so immature sometimes. I mean, it's just a ghost story. Anyway, I'm not feeling very well, so I won't be able to go to Tartarus tonight. Sorry. I'll always watch a little TV, then go to bed early. Who asked? We're not going to Tartarus today. Mitsuru is training, and Yukari has a weird feeling. I wonder what that means. Seems Yukari has a sixth sense when it comes to shadows. Actually, that's quite common. Dealing with shadows is a tendency to enhance other senses. Turn on the television. If you're an Aquarius, then your lucky color is red. For extra luck, try sticking your thumb up all day long. Wait. No. Junpei, what are you doing? Ah, my controller. Yukatan's freaking out for no reason. All I said to her is that someone might be in her room or under her bed or in her closet. I mean, come on, that's nothing to get worked up about, right? Go up behind the curtain. Oh, you like telling stories like that too? Just don't go too far when telling them you car. She'll freak out. That's not funny. Why not? You get scared easily like Yukari? I didn't expect that, but it's kind of cute. Oh my god, stupid. I can't sleep like this. I'd be happy to sleep with you if it helps. 
Maybe we should call the police or better yet, it's serious, senpai. P please, anything but that. But Mitsuru, are you actually here or are you, like, gone? Doesn't seem to be in our room. I'm sorry, but I'm in the middle of training my persona to search for enemies. Others appear to be busy as well. Let's postpone going to Tartarus tonight. Well, I wasn't going to go. You're not alone, so you can't watch the videos? What the hell's on them? Another victim of this mysterious incident is found at GeckoCon. Since the victim was at the front gate, that must be the scene of the crime. After all, the victim had been attacked somewhere else and then carried to the front gate. Why would the culprit do such a thing? The reasoning doesn't add up. Anyway, there's a high probability that GeckoCon itself is involved in all this somehow. Yeah, right, that's cool and all, but, uh, quiz game? Our last quiz game, we're almost out of money. Above average. <laughs> I think some of them get like nice names and then knowledge is just like, yeah, you're above average. No school today. No. The answer is no. Yo, Ju did we level you up last time? We did. Okay, it might actually be worth it. Because he took so long to level up last time. But I don't know. It's like, what if he levels up at one time this time and this is a waste? See, this is the times where like, you need a guide, <laughs> you know? But also, I'm like, we've rejected him like twice in a row. I feel like if we reject him again, he's going to get mad. You want to do something? Yeah, sure, whatever. We're waiting downstairs. Ah, oh, fuck. I mean, there's nothing we can do on Sundays anyway. Iwatoda Strip Mall, book on. Having a good time hanging out with Junpei. Ah, uh, came all this way and I want, and I couldn't even read one manga that I wanted to read. Seriously, who was holding on to the, all the volumes in that series? Junpei's a little angry. Since they don't have that, I forced us out to read through some of that shouju manga. You know, the ones where they're popular with girls now? I was curious what they'd be like. I gave up in half an hour. Reading those things wore me out. Junpei seems fed up. All those guys in those manga are either really good looking, really rich, or really smart. I mean, yeah, it's a manga. I know it's gotta be like that. But is this really the only kind of girl, guy a girl streams about? Um, I don't know, man. It's not reality. Really? Okay, okay, I think I get it. Girls are all into it because it's something they can't get in real life, right? And again, we got Persona, so our lives are kind of like manga too. Oh, when I think about it that way, it's pretty exciting. Junpei's getting excited. He is like a he is a small child at times. <laughs> you recall you have something you can give as a present. Uh, it's just a book cover, right? Nah. That's mine. I need that to cover my books. Where have you been? Potter seems to have an unstable formation today. There may be more accidents than usual. Be on your guard. You know about the computer behind the counter, right? The school makes us send them um, updates and all things are going here at the dorm. That's what Mitsuri's doing right now. Okay. Thought she was just vibing, but... Damn, rumors spread fast, especially this one. Everyone at school knows about it, and soon everyone in town will too. The victim was that girl who was bullying. It may just be a coincidence, but it doesn't, something about it doesn't seem right. What do you think? Throw in the towel. That sounds like Junpei brainwashed you. He's such an idiot. I mean, you're not wrong. Yeah, something's not right. Hey, don't scare me like that. Yeah, that's what I thought. I mean, part of me kind of does want to go to Tartarus to get, like, money, but... Because it's like, we can't do anything on Sundays. Because the arcade doesn't all it only offers the stat boosting stuff, which I don't care about. We have no social links available at night. And we could do like this and this, but it's like inefficient. We should try and sell some stuff to get a little bit more uh money. Plus one to all stats. I mean, defense-wise, it's still worse. But we could put that on Yukari. Strength. 
great tip. Alright, we'll keep- okay, we should equip the bulletproof vest. Actually, can we equip it? Is that unisex? Yes, everyone can be resistant. Oh, and you can't wear a sweater? Well, you can take the apron. Granted, I guess that actually makes more sense for us to have this and then give, like, the bulletproof vest to, like, one of you two. I don't know, I like Akihiko more, so you can have it. Yeah, I don't know. That, that gives us enough money to make it to the next story section, at least. For, for arcade gaming. What do you do here again? Pheromone coffee. We don't really need charm. We don't really need courage, either. What are we looking at? Alright, fine. We'll, we'll do some karaoke. Here we saw we're full at the moment! Yeah, yeah, I'll drink some damn coffee. Good morning. It seems to be a sense of restlessness in the air. Yeah, I agree. Well, I hope it doesn't have anything to do with the shadows. Akihiko said we may be receiving a new member, but we don't know when we'll be attacked. But remain alert at all times. Finally time for lunch! Oh, it's you. Funny ran into you here. I don't have a star. We, we won't talk to you for a long time, dude. Wait, this is right in front of your classroom, isn't it? See you later. Um... <laughs> um... I see. You wanna hang out then? I'm usually by the club rooms after school. The answer is, is a big fat no. Lunch break is almost over. Great, he didn't even ask. We're the one who proposed. Uh, you know these rumors? It's a little creepy. Oh, we're, we're in summer outfits. Rumors suck, man. What about the girl who collapses already all over the school? Hope no one spreads any rumors about me. Hope I never see a ghost. I'd be so freaked out that Akihiko Senpai wouldn't flinch for a moment. Man, it'd be awesome if Akihiko Senpai could be with me to protect me. Well, what the, what's he gonna do against a damn ghost? Punch it? Yeah, good fucking luck. Told you, she just happened to faint in front of the gate. Apathy syndrome is so over-exaggerated. They'll get better if you just give them some time. He said a girl in classroom C fainted too. Apathy syndrome again, right? I'm glad it wasn't someone in my class. Everyone's talking about ghosts and whatnot. I guess they're all really scared. I'm fine, though. But ghosts gave me trouble. Mitsui said I would cut it right in half. See her fight with a sword? I don't know if I can take it. How's she gonna cut with a rapier? She uses a rapier. How's she gonna cut with a rapier? See, you don't even know what you're talking about. God, this is why I hate people. Man, I can't even talk to Roof Guy. What's up? Flowers soon they're about to wilt. Can I do anything about it? Three days in a row we've had students at the school passing out. It's a hell of a mystery. I mentioned to know more. I should try looking into it. Never expected anything like this to happen to someone in, from this school. Sister goes here too. It's a good thing she's not the kind of girl who stays out all night. Hi there, welcome. Goodbye. As long as you pass your exams, you'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, that's what I always say. What are we gonna do? I mean, we could do student council. You gotta say anything? I'm waiting for my boyfriend. I'm scared about all the stuff that's been happening lately. So he's gonna walk me home. Bro, what the fuck is he gonna do against a ghost? I'm just saying. I'm not trying to be toxic. Yeah, sure. Ekercon High School Student Council Room. You work with the members of the Student Council. Hours flip. How are you gonna give me a filler event? Oh, maybe you didn't give me a filler event. 
Is Otagiri absent today? I don't know who that is. Uh, no, I think he's busy. Busy doing what? Busy playing Private Dig. Oh, is that Hidatoshi? Oh, you mean what Fushimi was telling me about earlier, I see. Well, his intentions are good, so you can't really blame him, but I understand how you feel. You can go if you'd like. I don't mind. Sorry for all the drama. Mitsuru, look how smart we are. Come on. You can lower your standards for us, can't you? We decide to leave the student council room. Gekron High School, first floor hallway. You hear someone yelling. So where's your evidence, smart guy? There's no need for evidence. I know all about you. You arrested for beating up a guy in the park and snitched on you, right? Hidatoshi approached the student. Oh, he's at it again. That's the third person today he's accused. My boyfriend was so pissed he was accused too. This guy's asking for it. Students around are only watching. Keeping quiet will do you no good. If it's not you, then give me some names. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. You have my word as a member of the disciplinary committee. Shut up, asshole. Looks like the punk's gonna hit Hitoshi. Uh, intervene. <laughs> We're gonna kick his ass. Hit him with our damn, uh, Naginata. The, pun the punk punched Hitoshi before you were able to stop him. The punk walked away. Hit him with our freaking uh, flying slice. I don't think I'll just let that go. Extra kid. I feel like you want to say something. Um, working hard, huh? Of course. Hitotoshi seems satisfied. If you let people get away with breaking the rules, things will only get worse. One day it'll spiral out of control and there'll be nothing we can do. But we should deal with the problem now while we still can. I know what people think of me. But those who carry out justice have always clashed with others. History has proven this to be true. But let this serve as a warning to the other offenders. Make sure, Kun, you're a sensible person. You understand, right? Since the heat of Toshi is beginning to trust you. Well, you should be stronger now. Yeah. I'm gonna get back to business. You should go home before it gets dark. Well, I could go home before it gets dark if you didn't forcibly enroll me into a student club. I already got like four clubs in the fashion club and the tennis club and student council. Gotta fight shadows at night. Dormitory lounge. We're talking with the others over dinner. Hey, Yucatan. Have you seen the posts on the student message board? We have a student message board? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Well, there's this rumor that it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story. Hey, come on. Nobody believes that stuff. Right? I mean, we basically fight ghosts every night. So, what is this ghost story about? And by every night, I mean like once a month. Because we're a god gamer who doesn't need more than one day to clear uh, Tartarus. Okay, maybe sometimes two days. What? It's probably made up, so why bother? I'm interested. Go ahead and tell us. Uh... Junpei leaned forward and spoke in a mysterious voice. You don't know where he got it, but he took out a flashlight. But the lights are still on. Good evening. <laughs> Welcome to Junpei's <laughs> Believe It or Don't. There are many strange things in this world. According to one story, if you get caught at school late at night, you'll be devoured by a maniacal ghost that roams the halls. The other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Shu, he said to me, Junpei, I saw something strange. In the neighborhood? Uh, who are you going to call? Additionally, we I have to, I can't suspend my disbelief that you have a friend. He sounded serious, so I asked him what he'd seen. He said it was about the girl in 2E. He claims he saw her go into the school on the night of the incident. I couldn't believe it. She's not the kind of girl to be out at night. You don't know her. But Shu was as white as a sheet. He insisted it was true. Then, it hit me. That ghost must have tried to make her its dinner. And that's why they found her lying on the ground by the gate. I felt a chill run down my spine, and I broke into a cold sweat. Yes, there are strange things in this world. Believe it or don't. Oh, wait, seriously, Junpei, you have a friend? What do you think, Akihiko? Huh? Not one word about my <laughs> frankly amazing performance just now? I think it's worth investigating. 
Wow, I didn't know you were afraid of ghosts, Yucatan. That's kind of funny. Hey, watch it. Fine, then let's investigate. We'll each ask around for the rest of the week. I'll prove to you that this ghost story is just an urban legend. I mean, we fight monsters. It's not that crazy of a leap of logic. I appreciate that. The story is a bit unnerving. Huh? <laughs> then I'll let you guys handle it. <laughs> just make sure you sleep with one eye open. What? I mean, at the end of the day, if a ghost attacks you, you're fucked. So, like, just accept it. There's no point being scared. The car seems to... Please. Thank you. Please? Okay, thank you. Why? You know, just go check out what she's doing and you'll know right away. Tello, please stop. Damn, rumors spread fast, especially this one. Everyone at school knows about it, and soon everyone in town will too. Hmm, this isn't good. So many inquiries from parents and reporters alike. Well, if Yukari isn't going, perhaps we shouldn't either. However, there may be ghosts haunting the school. How's it going? I'm busy researching the ghost story online. I'm gonna pass on Tartars today. I'm gonna quiz game it up anyway, so... Actually, we're not gonna quiz game. Today is Print Club. Another victim was found at the school. Print Club, Print Club. Dark Hour. Your room. Good evening. Hello. I came to see you again as I promised. How are you? Well, I was sleeping pretty good until... Let me sleep. That isn't very nice. Show a little courtesy. Bro, you broke into my freaking brain. Now, in another week, the moon will be full again. And the next ordeal will be upon you. So be careful. Yeah, I know. It's in the corner at all times. You don't have to wake me up. I'll come again. Write me a damn note, like on the wall or something, in blood. Boy disappeared. <laughs> okay, now I feel kind of bad. I feel like maybe I shouldn't have told him to fuck off. Morning. You know what? From this day forward, I'm going to do my best. Um, at? The ghost story? Did you already forget about what we talked about last night? Well, anyways. You better find out as much as you can, too. Remember, you have only until Friday. Counting on you, too. I'm not doing shit, right? Ah, this phrase. Mona Susa Maijiku also occurs in Ugetsu Monogatari. Of the Ugetsu Monogatari stories, I particularly fond of the one about the ghostly wife. Such an eerie yet poignant story. Speaking of which, I know a good ghost story you'd like to hear. You feel tired. Close your eyes? No. Then his friend who entered the tunnel with him suddenly began to scream. There's a girl right behind you. Right, and they ran back home, and he started to hear scratching noises each night, and a faint voice saying, Let me in. Let me in. But as far as he knew, the room adjacent to his was vacant. One night he decided to knock on the wall where the sounds were emanating from. Hmm. Right next to his ear, the voice came loud and clear. I'm here! And that's where the newest member of the family came from. He grew up to be just like an ordinary human. I'm just dreading the day he'll say he wants to marry some poor girl. Oops, there's the bell. Okay, class, that's... What? <laughs> the hell are you talking? If I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times. Japan is fucked. <laughs> Tuesday? Yo, feels kind of weird running you in the hall like this. I'm not stalking you or nothing. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, only if you're not busy. Lates. I never see a ghost. Hope I never see a ghost. Hey, bae. I don't have a temperance. I don't have a hermit. Did you hear? What? What is it? You don't know? Let me tell you something awesome, then. Mitsuri Senpai wants a man who, would, want a man who likes to study. If I became the smartest in my class, you might accept me, even though I'm a girl. Unfortunately, no. Unfortunately, no. Mitsuri Senpai would want a man who likes to study. Boy, what was that last part? That makes you my rival, too. You'll never beat me. Oh. Unfortunately, we have already given up before the battle even began. 
of course you'd want to have heard. Any man who hopes to get Mitsuri soon, but it has to be as intelligent as she is. My sister goes here too. It's a good thing she's not the kind of girl who stays out all night. Hello. I'm still looking for the smoker. Bro, get a fucking hobby, man. I never expected anything like this to happen from someone in, to someone from this school. You heading home? Yeah, when it comes, sorry, I'm busy. Aww. Oh, you passed your exam. Yeah, but if I just pass my exams, I'll only get to talk to Mitsuru. Chickadee might beat us. Can we talk to you? Everyone's talking about the ghost and that kind of stuff. I hate those kind of jokes. Like how they say the ghost will get you if you stay at school for too long? Uh, I better get going, see ya. Oh, I, I tried to move, but my controller wasn't cooperating. I think about talking to the old people. Try and finish them. Oh yeah, the girl who passed out? I heard she was here by herself. Seems mysterious, doesn't it? The real mystery is man. I guess that's supposed to mean. Anyway, I'm gonna have to pay attention to this incident. When I'm not looking at my cellular telephone. <laughs> my telephone that connects to the radio waves in the air to cellu cellularize stuff. It's really cool, okay? If it keeps up, you might get possessed by evil spirits. Oh, that's just a rumor, so maybe not. Damn, you're so persistent. We will call it. Oh, no. Please. Please come back. Thank you. We will call it here. Next time, we'll probably go talk to the old people. I think they're... Actually, I don't know if they're available these days. We can check real quick. It's Monday or Tuesdays they have off. Okay, no. We could, we could try and finish them. We might still need another one since it's ranked 10, but we'll see. I'm ExtraTreezy87. Stay tuned for the next part. And bye, guys.